We're back, and I gotta say, that is the happiest, most friendly skeleton I have ever seen the standing before me. But anyway, oh, 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 I must be dreaming. The sky, the wind, the sun. Am I finally free from the darkness? No. Uh, Excuse me. What, you? What, why is he? How dare you? What have you done to me? Ding. Who are you? Um, huh? How does it, how does he know him? Don't play dumb! You won't get off the hook that easy! You did this to me! I think I remember if I met some creepy floating skull. You must have mistaken me with someone else. What? You don't remember me? That, that means... Hold on a sec. Second. <laughs> I'm so sorry. I must have had a few cobwebs upstairs from the long years of darkness. You both saved me. And for that, I'm forever grateful. You are my heroes. Okay, whatever. I must find some way to thank you. My name is Barbaros. Barbaros? Is he the one? <laughs> yes, he is, by the way. I was brought to this state by a terrible, terrible curse. But I'm really a pirate. The Barbaros? The Barbaros from all the, all the legends about Treasure Island? You know about Treasure Island? Well then, I'll cut the introduction short. I'm the infamous pirate Barbaros, master of Treasure Island. Woo! Oh, he likes roast beef. I do like roast beef too. Roast beef is delicious. Okay. Ding! This is a bit of a surprise, isn't it, Zack? This man is a myth come to life! Well, he's sort of alive anyway. Let's keep chatting with him and see where this goes. So, your name is Zack. From your appearance, I'm assuming you're a pirate like myself. Of course you are! And I can just sense the greatness about you. I ask you, sir, for a favor. As one pirate to another. I was cursed, my body torn asunder and cast to the four winds. Would you be ever so kind and put me back together again? You'll have my eternal gratitude, and of course, I'll reward you for your kindness. What would you like? Don't hold back. Just speak whatever comes to your mind. Here it is, Zack. Now's your chance. Just say it. You know, the object of every pirate's dream. Woo! You know what he wants. So, huh? Hmm? Oh, everything. Things. And what? A legendary ship? Yeah. Yeah? Okay. <laughs> oh. My ship's become a legend, and you want her? Yep, yeah, I, I, I really like that. You got excellent taste. I know I sense greatness from you. Oh, she's a fine vessel. She'll get you anywhere you want to go in a jiffy. This is just between us pirates. But that ship is the reason I became such a world-renowned pirate in the first place. Alright, it's a deal. If you could put me back together, I'll take you to Treasure Island and give you the old girl. Yes, my legendary ship. The reward is set. I leave putting me back together in your capable hands, Zack. It's time to start the quest for Barbaros' treasure. Oh, or I guess not. By the way, you there. Huh, me? Yeah, you, the floaty one. You really don't know me? Me? Of course I know you. The legendary pirate Barbaros. Um, that, that's alright. Oh, never mind. Don't worry your little head about it. Oh my, I'm a bit tired. A curse body is such a difficult burden to bear. I need to rest my old bones. Farewell. Oh, what, what the heck? He j I just pocketed him. Hey boss, this is turning into quite an adventure. We're going to see set Treasure Island and score a legendary pirate ship. Yeah. Woo! Yeah. Let's start. Whatever danger awaits, I'll face it right by your side. You could always count on me. I think that treasure chest looks like it's kind of worth a lot of money too, you know? It's kind of golden and shiny and I I'd cash that in, you know? <laughs> anyway, this is the end of the first level. Jungle Ruins, a journey begins. The treasure you gathered is what you uh, kind of found in the, in the very beginning, you know, I mean throughout your adventure. And this was an unpuzzleable adventure. Woo! That means I did everything perfectly in the world. I'll explain that later. But for now, we're going to talk with our pirate pals back at our hideout. Woo! Actually, I shouldn't call it so much a hideout as it is a uh, 
just a, just a place to hang out with the, my other pirate buddies. Finally back at the height. I guess it is a hideout. Okay. I thought we were on a one-way trip to the other side for sure. Oh, Zach, we better tell everyone we're back. They'll be waiting to hear from us. Okay, let's talk to everyone real quick here. Let's talk to this bunny guy. This is Lofery. Hey, man, if you said I use the reroll, I could totally teach you. Well, maybe later when I'm not so busy. Can't I can. Works a drag. And there's a, ooh, I love spaghetti too. Spaghetti's delicious. Okay, you can practice the items you've run across before. Like if I wanted to test out that scent to saw, I can practice it by, you know, doing the, you know, you know, I won't go over that again, you know. <laughs> Anyway, let's check out uh, this icon right here. This appears to be a giant safe. This is where the legendary pirate parts are kept. You can look at parts or talk to the legend himself here. Woo! Looks like we got a lot of parts to get. I know my party, and boy, you are destined to be a great one. Keep it up. Okay, and the only 16 parts of rain until all our dreams come true. Bring back as many as you can. Yeah, I just hit the B button to get out of that. Let's talk to Granny here. Seek the Oracle, you need help the most. Just remember that even an Oracle has bills to pay, so be generously offering. Kee -kee -kee. And granting a oh, licorice isn't is pretty I mean, delightful. I mean, I like a licorice too. Buy okay. different things from Granny. I'm sure some of them will come in handy. Okay. Uh, you can buy a Oracle doll, which will give you one more chance if you should die in an area. And you can also buy a platinum. Oh, I mean, a platinum tick gives you one more chance in an area, and the Oracle doll gives you a hint about the area. This in this game is a puzzle game. The whole game is one giant puzzle, and I am going to show you the solution to e each and every one of them. Let's press the one button to see just how it is to call her out on the field. Oh, so wait, wait, that this isn't right. Oh, wait, hold on a sec. Oh, whoa, wait, oh, wait, oh, oh, yeah, oh, oh, there we go, okay. <laughs> oh, oh, so I guess they're different people, but okay. I am the oh, great and all-knowing oracle. Seek my counsel when thou hast lost their way. The time has come to make an offering of an oracle, doll. Um, I'll just say yeah for the heck of it. A deal has been sealed. Press the one button when counsel is sought. The path shall be made so clear so long as an offering is made. Oracle dolls may be obtained from the wonderful, charming store owner. I guess she's talking about Granny. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, whatever. I get the feeling that the Oracle won't be showing up in the hideout again. Okay, let's talk to Big Boy here. <laughs> This is the boss of the sea rabbits. He's supposed to be an amazing pirate, supposedly. And uh, everything is his favorite food. Wow, that's uh, kind of delicious for him. You know, I'm, I'm with him, too. Before you go on any grand, advent before grand treasure adventures, be sure to check with the boss first to let him know where you're going. And, uh, yeah, we can check what we just did. And there is what we just cleared. And a new area has opened up to us. That is called the Pit of Tragedy, but I'm not going to do that just yet, because we have more people to introduce ourselves to. Like this guy, right here. I heard something good, you want to know? This is Dimmy. His favorite food is ravioli. Oh, I love Italian food, thank you. I love it, I love it so much. This little guy always has his ears perked up for rumors. If you want some good info, you should check with him from time to time. And uh, let's check out the bookshelf over here. This gives us basically a... Hey, I said the bookshelf. This tells us what we have collected throughout the uh, throughout our adventures. This is pretty much empty right now, so I'm not going to go through it. In fact, I don't even know how you fill these things up. It seems like when you collect treasures, they don't appear in the books. Anyway, I'll, I'll talk to the last person in the next part. See you guys.